Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and uh, with this uh, update for the bug fixes, the uh, update preview, uh, once it will be installed on your PC, so either today if you want to install them yourself, or with Patch Tuesday of August, well, the blue screen of death will be a thing of the past on Windows 11. You will now be moving on to the black screen of death, which is still VSOD. But um, it will look like this, much, much simpler. Just a little message saying that the device ran into a problem, needs to restart a percentage of completeness, which is much, much faster, by the way, than the blue screen had to uh, send a report as to what happened. And, of course, at the bottom, a small uh, info about the stop code, what went wrong, and so that's pretty much it. So that is now the official error screen, which is not a good idea. Once again, I kind of said it in a previous post. And the reason why is because if you look at when you do Windows updates, you actually have a black screen with a percentage of completeness. So this could easily be taken into... Um, you know, mistaken into being a Windows Update page rather than a crash if you're not looking carefully at the screen. So uh, anyways, I have no idea why they did this change. It was absolutely unnecessary. Blue screen of debt has been with us forever, and I think it should have continued to be a blue screen of debt just to make it different from the Windows Update black screen, basically. So if you install the updates today, this is now going to be your new black, black screen of death. For those that uh, are not, well, when you get the patch Tuesday updates of August, it will install today's bug fixes and changes, and will, of course, bring this black screen of death to you also. So bye-bye, uh, blue screen, hello, black screen. That's pretty much it, and a much simpler uh, age of information. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.